find the best men's walking shoes on Amazon. We analyzed consumer reviews to find the top rated products. Find out which product I scored and buy. I am going to review top 5 best men's walking shoes on the market. 5. Nike Air Monarch 4. More than any other shoe we've ever known, this Nike sneaker embodies the essence of dadness. As if by magic, a mere glance at the stock photo can fill the air with the aromas of fresh cut grass and burgers on the grill. Cosmopolites scratch their heads, and suburbans bow to the almighty ensemble that is a t-shirt, jean shorts with a braided brown leather belt, white proof socks, and a pair of monarchs. Oh yeah this legend is also a shoe, not just a legend. Did I mention it's a legend? Actually, it's a shoe with a leather upper that provides durability for workouts, according to Nike. A full-length encapsulated air sole unit adds cushioning and support. The outsole grips any surface, but the treads are pretty toothless let's be honest, these beauties are for piloting the rider or handling the tongs, not walking around in the woods like some hippie. 4. New Balance 608 V5 Men's Walking Shoes all day wearability anchors the New Balance 608 V5 men's walking shoes. A highly cushioned midsole and flex grooves in the outsole make it one of the most comfortable walking shoes for men. It's an inexpensive shoe with a leather upper at MSRP $70. New Balance offers the 608 V5 in three widths to accommodate your foot shape. In fact, almost all the shoe's design strokes reflect its prioritization of comfort. The outsole's flex grooves, molded into the forefoot area, limit crinkling and abrasive break-in. An even midsole adds firm but flexible support. An internal shank protects the foot from surface inconsistencies. A polyurethane insole and dual layer collar cushioning deliver a final layer of comfort. Take one look at this new balance shoe, especially the tread, and you'll know it doesn't belong anywhere near the trail. But that's not the point it's a straightforward shoe geared toward comfort and wearability at a moderate to low price, and it checks each box. 3. A 6 Gel Venture 7 Men's Walking Shoes The Gel Venture 7 is a 6 running or walking shoe for everyone, with solid cushioning and heel construction, plus high rebound and a moderate MSRP. ASICS has this to say about its well-established gel technology, it attenuates shock during impact phase and allows for a smooth transition to mid-stance. Whatever this means, the tech has been perennially successful for ASICS. The ASICS Gel Venture 7 Men's Walking Shoes features gel technology in the rear foot. ASICS adds an internal heel counter to help retain foot position in the shoe, designed to shape the foot over time. An even midsole increases cushioning. Reversed lugs provide uphill and downhill traction on an outsole that features proprietary abrasion-resistant rubber and synthetic leather on the support of the upper bolster. A 6 also includes a sock liner that aids rebound absorbs moisture, and increases breathability. 2. New Balance 877 Men's Walking Shoes New Balance builds the 877 with a breathable suede and mesh upper and an impact-resistant sole well equipped with proprietary technology. As tested, the shoe had a generous toe box and a broad foundation. I felt the New Balance 877 men's walking shoes was a good smooth surface walking shoe for people with wide feet. Its reputation as one of the top-rated men's walking shoes is well-founded. New Balance uses grey suede to give the 877 a classic appeal and adds mesh lining and panels for breathability. I found the shoe kept my feet from sweating uncomfortably on strenuous hikes up to 5 miles in 90 degree plus heat. With its low weight, I also felt energetic and dexterous even when the miles started to pile up. That said, the 877 isn't a hiking shoe, and it didn't perform like one. The outsole's smooth tread works a lot better on pavement than it does on sandy or uneven surfaces, and it tested better on the sidewalk. 1. Skechers Afterburn Men's Walking Shoes I ventured into the land of memory foam insoles, not knowing what to expect. 
Now, I'm happy I've been there, but I won't be going back. The sturdy Skechers Afterburn men's walking shoes tested as heavily supportive, built for lasting comfort. A robust midsole is the shoe's foundation I was tall while wearing the afterburn, and I'm not a tall person. Moderately aggressive treads, a durable but relatively lightweight synthetic upper, and memory foam insole round out the shoe. The afterburn's tread performed well on various terrain. It gripped smooth rock respectably and delivered traction on loose gravel. Despite the shoe's hefty overall build, it didn't feel heavy or cumbersome I didn't unexpectedly kick anything or feel clumsy in it like I expected on my first impression. It also shook off abuse pretty well, refusing to fray or rip when snagged by low-lying branches during hikes. Too bad the afterburner's featured asset, its memory foam and soul, is actually its liability. Thanks for watching. You can find links, price, and more details of these products, in the description box. If you like this video please like and subscribe.